Hello everyone, so today I will share Korean food recipe that you can try at your home. Check this out. Spicy Korean Ramyun Beef Ramen is a Korean style noodle dish. Ramen can be made from wet noodles or instant noodles. Several brands of instant noodles are not only consumed in South Korea, but also exported to foreign countries such as China, Hong Kong, Macau, Japan and Indonesia. Korean ramen is basically spicy. Shin Ramen is the mainstream brand in Korea. A savory broth. The flavor I was aiming for with this dish is based on the standard Shin Ramyun from a packet. Up near the top we've got disodium guanylate and disodium anosinate. Two flavor enhancers that are designed to work in conjunction with monosodium glutamate to up the savoriness of food. It's a convenient and inexpensive way to make foods taste meaty without actually being too meaty. At home, I prefer using more natural sources for my glutamates and anosinates, and Japanese-style dashi broth proves to be just the ticket. Ingredients 1. 6-inch piece kombu 2 ounces niboshi or shaved katsuobushi 12 scallions, divided 2 tablespoons canola oil 2 pounds beef short ribs or oxtails 1 medium onion, split in half 1 3 inch knob ginger, cut into 3 slices 8 cloves garlic, divided 2 tablespoons gochujang, plus more to taste 1 tablespoon dubanjang 1 8 butter 2 quarts homemade or store bought low sodium chicken stock 1 tablespoon gochugaru plus more to taste 1 8 ounce jar cap 4 to 6 servings ramen style noodles 4 to 6 soft boiled eggs Directions A. Cover kombu with 1 quart cold water. Bring to a boil over medium-high heat. Immediately reduce heat to low and add niboshi or katsuobushi. Let step for 15 minutes, then drain broth and discard solids. Set aside. While broth simmers, roughly chop 8 scallions and set aside. Finely slice remaining 4 scallions. Do. Heat 1 tablespoon oil in a heavy Dutch oven or stock pot over high heat until lightly smoking. Add as many short ribs as fit in a single layer and cook, turning occasionally, until browned on all sides. Transfer to a large bowl and repeat until short ribs are all browned. Add onion, cut side down, and ginger to pot and cook until well browned, about 5 minutes. Add 6 cloves garlic and roughly chopped scallions and cook, stirring, until lightly browned, about 3 minutes. Return short ribs to pot along with gochujang and dubunjang. Stir to coat vegetables and beef in spice mixture. Then add strained kombu broth and chicken broth.
scraping up any brown bits from the bottom of the pot. Bring to a boil, reduce to a bare simmer, cover with the lid, and cook until beef easily separates from the bones about 4 hours. For best results, allow to cool and transfer to refrigerator overnight. Char. When ready to proceed, strain soup through a fine mesh strainer. Transfer liquid to a medium pot and skim off any excess fat. Pick out short ribs and transfer to a bowl. Discard remaining solids. When cool enough to handle, pick meat off of short rib bones. And transfer to a cutting board. Discard bones. Roughly chop meat and set aside. Punch. Add gochugaru to broth. Place a fine mesh strainer over the pot and strain kimchi juice into the broth. Finally mince remaining garlic with a garlic press or a microplane and stir into broth. Add soy sauce. Season broth with salt, pepper, and extra gochugaru and gochujang if a spicier flavor is desired. Bring to a simmer and keep warm. Che. Heat remaining tablespoon oil in a medium skillet over medium high heat until shimmering. Add mushrooms and cook until lightly browned, about 4 minutes. Add chopped short rib and cook. Tossing occasionally, until crisped in spots and well browned, about 5 minutes longer. Remove from heat and set aside. Saat. Cook ramen noodles according to package instructions. Divide into individual preheated serving bowls. Top with broth, followed by crisp beef and mushrooms, sliced scallions, kimchi, and a soft boiled egg split in half. Serve immediately. Notes All Asian ingredients can be found in Asian specialty markets or ordered online. Kombu is dried sea kelp. Katsuobushi is dried, smoked bonito. Niboshi are dried anchovies. Gochujang is a Korean chili bean paste. Dubanjang is a Chinese chili bean sauce. Gochugaru is Korean red pepper flakes. Thanks for watching this video. Don't forget to like, comment, share and subscribe this channel. See you later.